Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to fix out the issue. This file does not have an app associated with it for performing this action. So let's go ahead and fix out the issue. Open your settings menu. Click on the apps option. Here you need to choose default app. Scroll down. In the bottom of the page, you will find the option to reset all default apps. Click on this reset option to reset all the default apps and check your problem is fixed out or not. If this doesn't work out, in next method, click on start menu and type PowerShell. Run PowerShell as an administrator. Now here in PowerShell, you need to paste a command. Here it is. I will share this command in the description of this website. After that, hit the enter key. This will disable the development mode and then re-register your store app. So just wait for it to finish the process. Once the command is completed, close it and go ahead restart your PC and try to run or try to open the application again. Now it is still giving you the error. In next method click on the start menu and type CMD. Run CMD as an administrator. Here you need to type two commands one by one. First one is SFC space slash scan now and then hit the enter key. And the second command is DISM space slash online space slash cleanup image space slash restore help and hit the enter key again. I have provided you two different commands simultaneously but at your end make sure you perform each command one by one. Once command is finished don't forget to restart your system to make the changes taken place. Now, if this also doesn't work out, in next step, click on start menu and type run. In run application, type reg edit and then hit the enter key. In reg edit, click on the option edge key classes root. And here in address bar, type slash and type lnk file and hit the enter key. Now, in this right pane, you need to create a string with the name of is shortcut. It is already available over here. If it is not available, you can do is right click new and here click on the option string value and give it a name is shortcut and then hit the enter key. This value is already created. That's why it's not allowing me to create another one. But make sure you create the same name which is is shortcut over here. And don't forget to restart your PC after performing each step. Now, if this also fails, in next method, we have a tool that automatically diagnose and repair your Windows file. You need to scroll down and click on this download option to download it in your system. This is downloaded directly from the official Microsoft website. Once it is downloaded, go ahead and run the program. Click on the next button to continue. If you do not know the exact issue, you can choose all of the problems and click on the next button to continue. As it is saying that windows will shut down in about 10 minutes. So after 10 minutes, windows will automatically shut down. So make sure you restart your system by your own. Yes, it is also saying that the problem is already fixed. Now, if this method also, also doesn't work out, the last option we are left with is to do a repair upgrade. So for that, you need to open Microsoft official website and download Windows 10 or Windows 11 depending upon the type of system you have. 
I have Windows 11, so I'll download Windows 11 from here. In this Windows ISO image, select download, choose the language, and here is the download link. I have already downloaded Windows 11 for myself over here. Here it is Windows 11 for me. And for Windows 10 users, you need to click on this Windows 10 installation media to download this tool in your system. Once downloaded, go ahead and run the tool. Accept the terms and conditions. Now here you need to choose the option upgrade this PC now and click on the next button to continue. Make sure you are connected to the internet while performing this particular step because this will download your Windows 10 for you. Once it is downloaded, you will be prompt to upgrade your Windows 10 by choosing the option keep my file. So once you have chosen the keep my file, your Windows 10 will be upgraded to Windows 10 latest update once it is done go ahead and restart your system and try to run that particular application again this time your problem will be fixed out so these are the best possible ways to fix out your issue of this file does not have an app associated with it if this video works out for you i request you to please click on the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon to continue receiving more such updates from my channel thank you so much friends Thank you for watching.